If you want to quickly compose out a video, then what you can actually do is you can use the power of AI as well. So over here, I am in the home page of Clipchamp and you can see that create a video with AI is an option over here. So it says quickly auto compose a video by using your own media. So if you were to go around and click right here, now what you can do is you can add in a title. Let's say, for example, I'm going to go around and say, uh, like, let's say, for example, over here, I'm going to say scenery collection or my scenery collection right here. So let me just go around and type that in. And over here, you can see that you can choose what you're making, like holiday or wedding memories and others as well. So you can go around and say uh, my travel collection right here, just like this. So now you can add in your own media. So I'm going to go around and click to add in my own media right here. And over here in my TutorTube Drive, you can see that I got some media. I'm not going to select this, so I'm just going to select out everything right here and deselect this one right here and click on open. And once you do that, all of the video files, as you can see, gets uploaded over here just like this. So it does take a time depending on your internet connection right here. But now what this allows you to do, it, it allows you to create an edited video file without you having to do majority of the work. It'll detect out the type of content and then we'll edit out the video footages for you so that you can start using it right away. So once everything is loaded, you can go around and click on get started right here. And you can see that it says, tell us what style you uh, you would like for your video. So you can go around and see that this is what you have. You can choose for me or you can, let's say, for example, say no to this right here, no to this. Maybe you want the vibrant right here. Maybe you want the playful right here. No, you don't want bold maybe. No, you don't want organic or classic or editorial. Let me just go around and it says is finalizing the video now, as you can see, just like this. It says that's all for now and it's finalizing the video. Or you can directly choose, uh, like choose for me for it to, let's say for example, just choose the video out for you as well. So now what it is doing is that it is taking all of the media, it's analyzing, and then it's asking you whether you want uh, it uh, to be landscape or whether you want it to be portrait right here. And this is the video footage right here. You can make it full length or uh, you, you want your, uh, you can go around and define out your uh, video footage, a video to be less than 30 seconds, one minute, or you can go around onto portrait mode as well if you want. And similarly, your video will be prepared that way. But I'm just going to go around onto landscape right here and I'm sending, uh, clicking on full length right here or you can make it less than 30 seconds as well if you want to from over here and everything will be edited accordingly. Let me just go, go around and keep it short and keep it less than 30 seconds. So you can preview out the video if you want over here as well and you can see the different footages as I scrub over the timeline as well. But let me just go around and click on next right here. You can go around and choose the music as you like as well. But let me just keep it silent over here. And instead of exporting it, let me just go around and edit this further in timeline. And once you do that, what happens is that a new project opens up and you can see that all of the media that you have chosen uh, had, had, had been automatically, uh, like, uh, automatically been arranged into a timeline right here. And depending on what the AI thought was a very good effect, they have been applied as well. So let's just go around over here and you can go around and add in your own background music as well. But if I were to press the play button, you can see that this is what you have. It has some effects as you can see. And based on what I typed in, like it's a scenery collection. So everything was edited as you can see right here, just like this. You can go around and play it and you can see that this is what you have. The effect has been added in. This is uh, everything right here. And you can see that if you want to save a time and you quickly want to edit out a video, then this is something that you can do as well uh, to create out a product as you like. So this is what you have, as you can see, and that is how you can go around and uh, edit out videos by using the AI feature in Microsoft Clipchamp as well. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.